It's it's December something, and I forget. I don't know, man. Normally, it used to be written on the thing. Now it says day five. What's day five? <laughs> Who knows? Uh, hey there, one. This is Al Cow. It's day five of the 12 days of December. We'll almost have the halfway point. And uh, today, we got a thing, but it's the Jewers. So, um, the list says that it is a letter, but you can clearly see. Well, I mean, I can clearly feel it. I don't know if you can see, but there is an object inside it. It is not merely a letter, whatever it may be. Kind of cut it up there. It's my finger, all right. So we got some paper wrapping. It's pretty good. This is probably a letter. Nothing else in the envelope. It's pretty exciting. All right, well, check it out. Flip, flip, flip. Okay, this is kind of a long and... Okay, if I stretch out like that, I can kind of see. Merry Christmas, Rao Cow. Earlier this year, you did an LP of Bonk, one of my, one of the few must plays of the TurboGrafx 16. You mentioned before the LP, though, that the place you usually went to for retro video games didn't have TG16 games. In that regard, I thought it'd help you for the future and give you the only other turbo chip you need. SA Jewers. What does that mean? Whoop. Read message first. I did read it first. It's a good thing I flipped it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have known to read it first. Okay. Uh, is this is this going to be like a, a turbo game thing? Maybe. Oh, wait. Whoa. Okay, and also, there's this here. Um, I don't know if this is real. I mean, it's missing a part. Wait, where? I guess it's supposed to be here. Is this part of the... Okay. I don't... Oh, boy. Like, I don't know if this is a real letter, if it's just like a thing that was used. Alright, I'm going to rematch this puzzle here. Here we go. Okay. Being truthful, there's an SD card. Yeah, okay, so first of all, here is an actual... Kate Courage Alpha Zone, like actual turbo turbo game. But I did see that here in the back. There's a little body taped in. <laughs> Don't be shocked if you read the nothing in between. Alright, 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 okay. Here's alright. So okay, okay, being truthful, there's an SD card containing pretty much the entire Turbo 16, uh, Turbo FX 16, Turbo Graphic. Oh boy, I really messed up ripping that up. Project uh, PC Engine, PC Engine CD ROM 2, Super CD ROM 2, Arcade CD ROM 2, Super Graphics Library Santa. Uh, oh, wait, no, wait, wait, wait. Uh, that was not lined up correctly. Uh, yeah, no, that's a really unlucky rip. <laughs> Alright, um, it does not include unlicensed adult games by Hacker International, Excite Software Corp, or B Project. Most other unlicensed homegrown games are included, like the Christmas theme. Ah, Santa... Lantian? Does not include some non-software title, e.g. Artist Tools, the PC Engine Hyper... Catalog series or the ROM karaoke series. It does include compilation of standalone games, demos. I'm not sure demo has ever heard of PC Engine or prototype. It does not include most special versions of a game that were cut down for the next like, summer carnival or Hudson All Japan. See, here it's too damaged, and I'm not sure where things like version. If there were multiple version revisions, I only included one. If the game has a Japanese release uh, on ROM, okay. I pre-patched it for you. Patching a CD game can be a bit uh, of a pain. Yeah, see, I got, I got sort of like mixed up there. And you'll probably need this for when Rondo of Blonde is picked on the bucket list. To save on space, all the CD titles are converted into MAME SCHD format 
but now I'll feel the compressed to zip. And then that fin doesn't currently support the CHD, so I include a copy of the emulator Ares, which does AF, AAK, that or RetroArch can handle CHD, as well as tool that can convert them back into FBINQ for Mednefin, which is what I use to play Bonk. There's also a thing so you can see all the game there if you ever want to scroll through or play something off camera. Hopefully this helps you when a Patapon inevitably selects Military Madness, Magical Chase, Asuka something, New Adventure Island, Pac-Land Space Harrier, or Toilet Kids. Wow, man, so very unlucky tear there. Made this hard mode letter reading. <laughs> I feel kind of bad. I do feel bad. This is the danger of using a letter as part of wrapping, I think, because it turns out doing the rip was easier than dealing with a piece of tape that existed there. Yeah, right here. See, this here is the cause of all our problems. You got to be careful about these things. But this is a very you gift, and I mean, I love that. That is so cool. I'm not sure how to get that into my computer. I'm sure people will know how I can do that. Like, I don't know if I have a reader for, like, that chip in particular. I mean, maybe, and I'm not aware of it. Maybe, and I'm not aware of it. That's my story. But hey, we also get a physical ambush, as per tradition. Pizza did not officially enlist into the thing, but he sent me a thing anyways. I don't know what it's going to be. I, I took the liberty of cutting open the Amazon box ahead of time. All I know is that it's going to be a... What is this? A practical gift. Is that a, a water thing? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, this thing is huge uh, for pothole and buck and broncos. Uh, all right, uh, so yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's like a mug of some kind, right? It's a thermos, and it's not gonna bump around. It's over engineered. All right. <laughs> Speak resistance, good. Oh, this thing is heavy. Yeah, this thing is like super heavy. Well, yeah, it's 30 ounces. That's a lot. I normally drink from like a one liter bottle, but this might be easier to fill up though without like causing like a whole thing. Well, that is cool though. That is actually really neat. Like, thank you. Like for real, like I, I like this. I'm, that is really cool. Uh, unexpected. <laughs> Thanks, Visa. Now we'll move on to the genital word. December 17th, that's where we are. <laughs> that's the day we're at. So today's a bit of a break day in terms of ambush, which is fine. Uh, I think it's absolutely normal, especially since it is fully and completely uncoordinated. Today we got like the two people who seem to just have like a daily thing. Well, 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 how cow, on the fifth day of Christmas, you receive an NRL envelope. Yeah, that's right. Uh, <laughs> no, I, I have been careful. I did not throw it against any walls. Also, I know what it is. <laughs> Defy gravity extended. Defy gravity. I don't know if I know about this. I mean, the name is exciting. I love gravity circuit. Wrote trialer by accident, but it gave me the thing anyways. Um. Wow, this is like from 12 years ago. Well, let's go with the earliest one with the least amount of views. I don't know if it's. A, I'm assuming it's a real. Oh jeez. Okay. These are. This is video resolution. Okay. So like, yeah. Okay. Okay. So yeah, you got, you got, you got a platformer, and you got orbs in the air, keeping you afloat in the games. Okay. So I'm thinking this is a fan trailer. Then maybe if the game is that old, uh, I don't know. Okay. You shoot to do things, which you know would make sense in space. Yeah. Fight with gravity, not with gravity. Whoa. Okay, there is some fun stuff going on in there that we can see. And that just kind of looks like a sliced apple. The most dangerous force known in space. Uh, 
Yeah, yeah, so you got like a gravity gun that like does like a whole thing. Whoa, okay. Okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty exciting. I see what's going on here. It's a, it's a gravity gimmick kind of game. That looks super rad. I'm going to add it to my library. What you gotta do about that, huh? Then Amya's here. Amya's like Final Fantasy. Wild. Kaurao. This has a sequel over that released outside Japan before it did. Before it did. Okay. Uh, Final Fantasy V, or V, if you don't know Roman letters, numbers, expands on the job system and also introduces a certain recurring antagonist. That's right. This is the inclusion of the Moogles. No, um, I don't actually know what it is. Wait, Final Fantasy V, is that not uh, Encounter on the Bridge? That classic vip piece of music. Is that not for Final Fantasy V? Comes to life, new graphics, 2D pixel remaster, model take, world renowned, timeless story told, charming retro graphics. You've heard the spiel, but it's okay. Final Fantasy V, I feel like I know very little about that. Um, I think I saw footage of it during a person's series, but, like, I feel like I remember nothing about it. For some reason, they didn't want to translate it to North American sector. Like, I, like what's up with that? I do wonder why, they, like, is, does it just have too much text? Because Final Fantasy VI has a lot of text, and they translated that one. I guess they were confident about VI's success. In a way that they were not with five, and I have always found that curious. But thank you. Thank you, Anya. Thank you, SA Jewers, keeping this little bit here alive by sheer accident. You know what? I'm all here for it.